all right guys welcome on in to the next let's play we're gonna tackle we are on a soul streak we have went through bloodborne we've went through uh demon souls and now we are tackling the first the first of the dark souls series all right so i already kind of have an idea on um my build uh so let's go ahead and just jump into New game I bumped uh, the brightness up to seven so you guys can kind of see I know it might look a little bright but I don't want I don't want it to be too dark um, I'm gonna keep these at seven for now I might bump them up depending on how this first episode sounds I mean right now it looks like the sound is uh, doing pretty good uh, there's nothing I want to change here yeah we don't want to change any of that. Okay, so the build I'm planning on doing is good, is a uh, strength faith build. Um, so class, um, we have warrior, which is uh, eleven vit, twelve endurance, thirteen thirteen strength dex, resistance is at eleven nine intelligence of faith. Uh, then you have your quality build, your knight, which is 14 vit, 10 endur uh, endurance and attunement, 11 strength and dex, 10 resistance, 9 intelligence, and 11 faith. So honestly, like this one wouldn't be too bad, but I want a little more strength out the get-go. Um, I'll probably be doing um, leveling up my faith uh, later on, not, not just right away. Uh, Wander is more more of a dex build. I thought about the thief, but it's like okay, that's that's a lot of dex. Um, this is the one we're gonna go with. We're gonna go with bandit. Uh, so 14 endurance and strength. A little low on the dex, but I mean that's not bad. It's 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 nine. Um, and then the faith is at ten. So that's that's not too bad for what we want. Um, and then obviously your others. So let's go ahead and jump into bandit. And I do apologize now if you hear the dog in the background. She is really going to town on that bone. <laughs> She's just like she she loves chewing on bones as I'm like recording. It's great, love it. Uh, I hate all the hairstyles. Like none of these are like really close to like what I have. So like we're just gonna go with the Leon hairstyle, um, dark brown. And that's about it. That's about all we can uh, we can customize. I mean, we could go in and do some dials, but you can't add a beer, can't no, none of that shit. That's so it kind of just is what it is. Honestly, I kind of want to go like heavy armor, strength, faith, because like I've out of like all the Souls games or the Souls like playthroughs and stuff that I've done. Never once done a heavy armor build, so I kind of want to do it. So let's go ahead and jump on in. In the age of ancients, the world was unformed, shrouded by fog. A land of grey crags, arch trees, and everlasting dragons. But then there was fire, and with fire came disparity, heat and cold, life and death, and of course, light and dark. Then, from the dark, they came and found the souls of lords within the flame. Nito, the first of the day. That was so cool. <laughs> that is... It still has aged well. The Witch of Izanith, 
and her daughters of chaos. Gwyn, the Lord of Sunlight, and his faithful knights. And the furtive pygmy, so easily forgotten. With the strength of lords, they challenged the dragons. Gwyn's mighty lords. Ooh, lightning spear! <laughs> oh, I want lightning spear so bad. All right. Oh man, I'm still uh, remembering my first time going through this, and it's like yes, indeed. The dark like uh, the holy shit, the, the nostalgia. Undead. I didn't know what I was doing. I had no idea and about builds. Like... I had like I was just like, oh, I'm gonna try Dark Souls. Uh, okay, this looks good. This looks good. This looks good. Fuck, I can't use this. <laughs> Where they are locked away to await the end of the world. So this one I haven't beaten too many times. Is your fate. I don't quite remember uh NPC quest lines but I will try <laughs> I will try to remember hopefully it's not like it's not gonna be like my demon souls playthrough where I just missed like all of the fucking NPC quest lines And guys like oh shit that, that's that's a piece of candy I did choose I didn't even ugh, I, I thought I looked hey okay, I did I did I wanted to make sure I chose the master key let me in there don't tell me what to do I don't know what I'm doing. Howdy, stranger. Do 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 do. I remember the like the first time I played this. I look forever in this area. I just I don't know why. I just did. I was like, I think it was like an hour <laughs> that I spent in this area. Don't know why. I just did.
I like how this glass already starts with a spider shield. I'm gonna get you. I'm coming to get you. I'm coming to get you. Oh, okay. I'm waving at you now. It's that weird, uh, motion thing that PlayStation has. Oh, he was just waving back. I'm like, did, did you just wave back at me? <laughs> Wait, what? Did we just get a short bow already? <laughs> what do I need? What do I need? 12 decks. Okay, we got that. That's crazy. First enemy I kill drops a short bow. <laughs> I don't know if that's like a normal, normal drop, but... That's right, that's that's later on. Yeah, it's mostly gonna be like a quality, like strength, strength, faith build. I kinda wanna be able to like wield whatever I wanna wield. Um, but we're probably going to be leaning away from um leaning away from uh using Oh, magic, because I just did magic in um, Demon Souls, and I just realized I completely blew through all of his dialogue. <laughs> well, more than likely you guys have seen it, seen it, uh, or have played this or seen it before, so I'll try not to do it on the next ones, but... I just, I... Just out of habit, and was just like, blast through the dialogue. Howdy, folks. Here I come. Give me that backstab. Oh. Howdy, partner. You looking to get parried? <laughs> Sit down, bitch. And then obviously this is when you come back. Do 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 no 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 do 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 Let me at him. Let me at him let, let me at him let me at him let me at him plunge There goes half his health bar Woo. No hit run. <laughs> As you know, he's so he's so hard to get a no hit no hit run on. You hear the stomping? That's because there's another one. You know what? I do want to try it. Check something out though before like we just sprint. Sprint through this. Uh or that. Like probably because I don't have any arrows. I, I just wanted to see how the bow work uh bow uh works in this one. Be wary of charging! Only in the ancient legends it is stated that one day an undead shall be Take me away, pigeon! <laughs> <laughs> to leave the undead asylum in pilgrimage to the land of the ancient lords. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry, I had to. Lordran. Welcome to Lodren. Thanks for the ride, bird. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. 
Okay, and Lordran, level up and Kindle at Nonfit. Hey, okay, um. We want one, and then everything else into strength. So you guys could probably already tell what my plan is. So we're going strength faith build. First thing we're gonna do before we head anywhere else is we're gonna go to the grave of the cat the, the graveyard over here before the uh, the catacombs. It's really, this is kind of like a later on area, but I want a weapon that is here. Actually, I'm just gonna kind of like suicide run this and just grab everything that I can. big thing that we want is this right here that's gonna be the weapon I'm gonna be running no 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 I'm gonna try not to die oh damn it he did the slam and that slam had crazy range I don't think there are, I don't think there was anything over there um but hey like I said more than likely was gonna be a suicide run so with the Zwei hander um we need 24 strength so that is why we're already pumping pumping points into strength and out of the grit the ultra great swords it is the lightest so well, what kept me get, but there's no shit i'm doing it again <laughs> you would have done better to rot in the undead asylum but too late now <sighs> well since you're here let me help you out. There are actually two bells of awakening. One's up above in the undead church. The other is far, far below in the ruins at the base of Blight Town. Ring them both and something happens. Brilliant, right? Not much to go on. But I have a feeling that won't stop you. So, off you go. It is why you came, isn't it? to this accursed land of the undead. <laughs> I love that. Just every... Almost every Souls NPC, as soon as they're done tonguing... Ah, 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 ah. Okay, so we're at 15.4 out of 54. It feels like we're fat rolling, though. I don't know, maybe it's because I've just been I've been playing Demon Souls, but it, it feels like that's a fat roll. At 14 point Alright. Guess it's not. Um How many souls do I need to get? Damn it. Hey fuck, I keep doing it, man. But I also hear no. His name is like Petros or something like that? Oh my. Oh, I know. I have to awake my companion. So what if I were to teach you some wood that I mean, honestly, they, they speak really slow. So I'm gonna well. kind of go through it. Like it's gonna be up there long enough for you to be able to read it, but I'm not gonna sit there and wait for them to completely finish now, the only their ultimate their sentence. Will be Learn gesture, shrug. Uh, purchase item. What do we need for the talisman? We need a thousand. Um, and honestly, I wouldn't mind getting at least heal. Um, force it. Force could be pretty funny when you're doing uh, invasions. So okay, let's just focus on getting a thousand for now, and then we will. Uh, we can get this stuff. That or I worry about getting that stuff later. And we will get, um, we'll just get the Zwei Hander. I think I kind of want to get the Zwei Hander first. Okay, so let's kind of roam around here. See what... See what we can find. Um, I think we got a couple souls. See if it's enough to get anything out of. Yeah, 
I don't remember. Does it say how much you need in this? No, it does not. That, oh, dude, that's such a good quality of life. It needs that. We're going to be really, really strunky. Like right out the gate. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. This is her. So we reinforce our... This is flasks through... Um... Yeah. Go down here. I think we're gonna go suicide run for another really good weapon that I might use until we can get this Y hander. But the only way you can get this weapon is by uh, getting the master key at the start. Um, so this will be obviously an probably another um, suicide run, but I don't know. I've been lucky to be able to grab it and the other items around it, and then. Get the hell out of there before dying. Let's grab whatever items that are around here. This is like a way later area. There's S stock. We're not gonna run that. And there's an item here. for later on so if you're doing a mage playthrough the uh the nice thing is that going down this or that elevator there's a little walk walkway right down here next to the dude that's just chilling he's over here chilling like a villain look at him he's so happy uh come down here and in this cage is a npc that will sell you Rickert is his name. So, you can actually upgrade weapons through him too. But you can modify equipment, you can reinforce the weapon, reinforce your armor, repair equipment. But, he does sell magic stuff. So I think if you choose the sorcerer, you get, you start with soul arrow, but only 4,000 to get heavy soul arrow? I mean, you'd have some pretty good spells early on. So let's go up here. Um, think. Yep, master key opens this up. Instantly to our left is a larger soul. That'll take you the easy way to Blight Town. Um, but if you go this way, this way will take you to um this sleeping dragon. And one of the items next to him is honestly one of the, I would say it's probably the best uh, straight sword in the game. Really good for a faith build. So he will wake up and he will one shot you because he is much later on. But if you're fast enough, you can grab the two. So now that we have that, we can probably wield this. Yeah, we can. Well, no. My faith is only at 10. But it doesn't show the red X. So let's let's try it and see what happens. Oh, no. Unable to wield it efficiently. Yeah, I'll probably have my strength up by the time... Uh, I get my faith to, uh, to be able to use that. So we'll probably already be rocking this Y-hander. Back here's an item. Fire bombs. We're already chilling at 20, 20... Almost 25 minutes. So we've already got this Y-hander. Uh, wasn't there an item up on the ledge up here? You go out this way. Go up the stairs. I think there's an item up here. Yep. Oh, 
Oh, lost and then. Okay, so let's, let's go ahead and pop the candy. See if we can get any levels out of it. Like the sooner I can rock the Zwei Hander, the better. So there's 19. Just five more levels. All right, so we have four minutes. Around four minutes until we're at 30. We're gonna go ahead and get, kind of just run and go grab this uh, uh, next bonfire. Hi, buddy. Come on. Time that like just right. Oh, you jerk. Hey, bro, I get it. I'm really not worried about you right now. You will have your time. And you will die. I wonder if I don't have the stats to wield the battle axe efficiently. <laughs> it's like, I... Looks like I just like throw my whole ass into it every time I swing. Twelve and eight. Yeah, I have the I have the stats. Just maybe that's just how the the, the attacks are. You just throw your whole ass into it. Hey, it's I have to remember her now because I just came from Demon Souls that you can run and jump in this. <laughs> Ooh, that was almost bad. I almost missed that. I think this is... Humanity, isn't it? No, Ring of Sacrifice. That's right. I was like, I couldn't remember if it was Humanity or Ring of Sacrifice. Okay. We don't have much more to run through. Just come up here. I think there's an item at the top and another soul. Down here to our left is a rat. Shit. Okay, I was about to say I'm gonna have a hard time in this. Soul of the Lost Undead. I really like the look of this spider shield. I don't know why I have never used it. Really like that red chrome. Oh, nice. Two for one. How did mister? You gonna throw a firebomb at me? Yeah, you are. Guess what? I got that for you. Oh, 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 bro, 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 bro. Don't even. You almost fucking needed me off the ledge. <laughs> he was trying to, he was trying to be cheeky. You're like, I see an opportunity. I wonder. Oh, I don't have it. I was gonna say, I wonder if I could leave a note. I wanted to put, uh, see if I could put like no, no sign of demons ahead or something like that. Another soul of a lost undead. Get that later. Dragon. I thought they said that the dragons were gone. That was a dragon. And it is very much alive. I want to get my decks up a little bit so I can, uh, can, uh, cut that thing's tail off. So you can get the, uh, the Drake sword. Wow, we, uh, we got to the bonfire pretty, uh, pretty quick. In this door, should be item around the corner. Wooden shield. Uh, in this way... You can tell that I've uh, kind of done this quite a bit. And backstab him. Boop. 
And go ahead and lunge at me. We'll go ahead and get a back stab off you. Yep. Now let's go ahead and drop on down. Guy back here trying to be all cheeky and stuff. Ersh. What do you have for me? Direct round shield, nice. And then here is the undead merchant. Which things you want from him are the residence key, repair box, bottomless box. Um. Oh, he has arrows. Don't really care about any of those. Uh, and then didn't he have the notes? Stuff for the notes? Yeah, right there. Orange guidance soapstone, so you can view, rate, and leave your own messages. Um, and then uh, dried finger if you want to summon in more than just what is it? Two? I think two. But if you have the dried finger, you could summon in three. Um, honestly, I'm gonna wait on this and this and all these three things until I get my strength up. Thank you, Kai. <laughs> but then we'll be back to get all that fun stuff. Oh, I, I really want to just say screw it and go through this this entire area. I mean, we're at we're at like 32. I think we can do it. I'm one shotting everything like this is kind of ridiculous. Oh, it's because I'm a strunky boy. Okay, so then boop, throwing knives. At least with this one, I don't have to worry about uh, item burden. That was definitely something new for me. Not used to having to worry about item, like your item burden. Just used to being able to pull as much as I, like my little heart desires. Batty. Oh. That's right. This one doesn't have the, the tool belt. Oh, ba -ba 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 How do I do this? Oh, here it is. Great message. How much you want to? How much you want to bet? It says try tongue butthole. Oh, close enough. Try plunging attack. Weirdo. Okay, now, now we can go this way. He's trying to come at me. Somebody's trying to come at me. I hear you. Large soul. Ambush. Watch out. Look at those guys. Man, if I had arrows. Pop, 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 pop. Drop them all. I don't think there was anything back this way. It was just a dead end. I already missed her. I was going to just try like a regular swing, but regular swings are more of a sweep for me. So yeah, that wasn't going to happen. Do 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 do. Behind you, behind you. All that for some rubbish. Woo. Yeah, I just kind of wanted to get through this side of the, uh, of this area um because i mean really we could have done all of this and probably in its own episode but uh i don't know i just wanted to tackle it. tackle it now just get it done and over with i mean honestly we've made a, a say for a first episode we've made a lot of progression i want to see if we have enough levels between what I have and what I can pop if we can get the Zweihander uh, if it'll be you know, wieldable
We have 3,000, which is pretty good. Let's go ahead and light that. Rest. Level up. Oh. Two levels away. Ah. Uh, be crazy to have this white hander, like. Be able to use it. Like, before we even fight uh, the first boss. Well, the second boss, but the first boss outside outside of the uh, the tutorial. But anyway, I think that's a good place to wrap it up. So thanks for tuning in, guys. I will catch you in the next one.